In April 2013, Abhishek Sengupta drowned at the Mid-Atlantic Tough Mudder in Gerardstown, West Virginia on a water obstacle called Walk the Plank. Avi was the first person to die from injuries sustained while running a Tough Mudder course. Just a split second after Avi steps off the platform, a woman in red jumps off and lands in the water very close to where he went in. One of the dominant hypotheses now as to what happened under the water is that a participant landed on him. Oh, shit, they're going in for somebody's drowning. Somebody's drowning. His friend, Deontay Wilkinson, started panicking on the platform because he realized that Avi had not resurfaced. That's Arshan Mirshaw, who was Avi's teammate and boss at Web Mechanics. And he's alerting the lifeguard to the fact that their friend has not resurfaced. Dude, get your mask on. About go. two minutes passed between the time that Avi jumped and when the lifeguards finally oh, ordered the rescue diver Mask into the water. Go down there. When the rescue diver got into the water, he didn't have his tank on. And there were other participants on shore who were yelling at the lifeguard the entire time, yelling at him to get in the water. And the rescue diver wasted critical seconds yelling at those participants oh, to get out of the Christ, water. This guy. On the day that Abhishek Sengupta drowned, the water was so muddy that you couldn't see anything under the surface of the water from the deck at all. Witnesses reported slow responses from safety officials and the on-site rescue diver, and Avi's family is currently pursuing legal action based on those claims. up and go across. One fucking diver out here, that's not good, dude. The actual amount of time that Avi was underwater remains unclear, though, Based on the video footage alone, it's clear that he was underwater for at least eight and a half minutes and as long as ten and a half minutes. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. They're trying to fight they're praying right now, dude. They're praying that they they're trying to revive him. Oh he's down in Fred, he's done. I know. Yeah. Avi had a pulse on life support, but he was essentially brain dead. And the following day, April 21st, his parents made the decision to withdraw life support and he died.